Hello everyone and welcome to exercise 20, Project Constraint, in your Rhino Training Manual Level 1. For this exercise, we will be using the auxiliary model called Constraints, just as you were using in exercises 18 and 19. The first thing we're going to do is make sure that ortho is on, right? In this case, it's on. And uh, for demonstration purposes, right, so you can see the difference, please make sure that project is off, like so, okay. And now, go ahead and go to your layers and reveal layer 2 and hide layer 1. Now, in your top viewport, we want to make sure we can see everything. So go ahead and go to your set view tab and select zoom extends. There we go. Now you want to kind of zoom out and orbit as necessary in your perspective viewport so that as we draw in our top viewport we can immediately see what's going on in the perspective viewport as well. All right now we're going to begin by drawing a polyline around the perimeter of these three rectangular surfaces. There we are. And in the perspective view, notice how the planar nature of the polyline has been overridden by the object snaps. All right, now go ahead and delete the polyline. And now let's go ahead and turn on the project constraint down here in our toolbar. Now again, working in our top viewport, once more, let's draw a line a polyline around the perimeter of these three rectangular surfaces. Look in the perspective viewport as you draw the polyline and note how the object snaps for the endpoints of the green and blue rectangles are projected to the construction plane. The project constraint forces all the segments of the polyline onto the construction plane the resulting polyline is planar. And this concludes exercise 20.